I'm not sure who needs to hear this message, but God placed this message on my heart. Whoever you are that's watching this video, I promise you this video is going to help you out. So stay tuned into the end. So I'm going to get right into it. You see, sometimes I like to come and get a little workout, right? And I got to be completely honest with you. I'm not that person that goes super intense in the gym. I'm a person that go in there, you know, I get a little something in and then I roll out. Here's what the Lord showed me about this situation. You know, sometimes I, I'm a, like I say, I'm gonna be honest, man. You know, and this may be a little TMI, which stands for too much information. I just helped you out. You ain't know what that meant, did you? You know, sometimes, you know, I look at myself and I say, man, I still look a little, a little flabby. You know what I'm saying? Like, like sometimes I look at myself and I'll be like, man, right here in this area, like I, man, you what they call it, love handles. You know what I'm saying? Uh, fat. I don't know what the proper term is for it, but sometimes, you know, I'm like, man, like I, I, I could do better. You know, like I might go in the gym. You know what I mean? I might hit them arms. I might hit a little back. Might hit a little chest. Might hit a little neck, little knuckle, little kneecap. <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. But you know, I might do, you know, little legs, do, do, do like little basic stuff. But to, but to be real with you, I ain't never really go after that core or those abs like talking about. You know what I'm saying? I always skip over that. You know, but why? Because because it hurt. I, I ain't want I ain't one of these dudes that's about to be laying on his back doing scissor kicks for no. Forget all that. I mean, you know it. That ain't the kind of pain that that ain't the kind of pain that I want. Dude doing scissor kicks, doing his legs like that ain't me. And I had to be real with myself, I had to look in the mirror and say, you know what? It's time for you to go to a new level. You understand? See, many of us, we we're running from the very thing we should be running to. I'm gonna say it again. Some of us, an obstacle, a situation come in front of, and what we do, first thing we do, we run from it. But you got to learn to run to that thing. I got to tell myself, you know what? It's about time for you to start doing some sit-ups. I'm going to be real. I'm, hey, I'm talking to you just how I'm, just how I talk to myself. I'm going to be, I'm being transparent. I ain't got nothing to hide. Because see, transparency breaks chains. And, and, and see, perhaps there's something in your life that you're in denial about. It ain't got to be, you know, fitness related or this or that. But you you, you you, need to pull this mirror down. Everybody got one of them inside your vehicle. If you don't, hey, it's all good. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Use the camera on your phone. Turn it around. But you got to look at yourself and be real. Because, see, you can fool all the people in the world, but you can't fool yourself. I had to tell myself, hey, man, you looking a little chubby, dude. All right? And hey, 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 let, let, let's be real. I mean, you done killed the arms in the gym. You done killed the shoulder. You, you did all that. But you're looking like a little muffin top. All right? You're looking, you're looking like a little muffin. And I told myself, I say, all right, so we're going to have to do something about this. From now on, before you do any other body part, you need to do about five sets of 20 on your sit-ups. And I say, all right, cool. That's... That's manageable. I can get that out the way. Guess what, self? Over the course of a whole year, you're going to look completely different. Because see, inch by inch, anything is, anything's a cinch. Meaning you got to break this thing down into small increments, attainable things. Because if I was to tell myself, I'm going to go in that, in, in that place and do an hour of crunch, I ain't going. Nope, I ain't going. Why? Because I'm not there yet. My, I'm going to be real. See, the Bible says that God has given us the measure of faith. See, my faith ain't there yet. I'm going to be real in that category. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know? So I got to break this thing down small and say, you know what? I'm going to start practical. So I'm just making this video as I'm talking to myself before I go in that gym back there. Shout out to this one guy. Hey, man, I got to give you a props. He was on it. You know what I'm saying? I don't know if you had good intentions or bad in intentions. This dude typed me exactly the location. <laughs> this dude typed the look, typed me the exact place I was at, location, at, at like uh city, everything. Hey, you must be. I know what you did though. You probably typed in that store or a Google or something. You Google about three of them things and seen where they where they all at and tell me why well, you smart man. All right, but don't come out here with that foolishness. Now I'm gonna let you know. All right, 
hey, don't let the smile fool you. Don't come out here with that foolishness now. But nah, man, uh, whatever it is that you need to work on, you know what I'm saying? You you, you got to be real about it. Self-accountability is important. And what God was showing me is, see, one thing you have to be with yourself is you have to be real. That's not a put down on yourself. That's being real. I could go in here and work out arms for days and it can be a workout, but it's really not a workout for me because I'm used to just doing that, that kind of stuff. See, a workout is meant to, to, to be challenging. When you stretch your faith inside, it, it, it's a pull. It's bringing you to a new level. So as God put that on my heart, I, I believe he was showing me to, to kind of share that for whoever to look at their life and say, man, I, I, I'm going to be real. I've been running from this. I'm not sure. Maybe you got a bad attitude. Maybe you curse people out like somebody in traffic cut you off you stick your middle finger out you go off on them. maybe you know you 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 speak a certain way to your spouse that's inappropriate maybe you speak to your kids a certain way that's inappropriate maybe you are always showing up late for work and you need to leave the house five minutes earlier ten minutes earlier you understand maybe you need to uh i don't know manage your money better but you try to put it off by saying, oh, only reason why I did that because they had that sale over there. You know, they, they say 50% off or whatever. Let, let me help you out. They telling you 50% off because they done jacked the price up 50%, but you, ain't, you don't know that part. You understand? They jacked the price up 50% off. They send you a coupon 50% off. And what you do? Start running head first into the store. Time I got my coupon. They like, yeah, all right, come on. I'll get you on, I'll, on, on register number one. Why is that? <laughs> you silly. You silly. That's why they got you, man. Hey, listen. So many people get caught up in the cheese that they forget about the trap. See, it's just like a mouse. A mouse ain't just going to stick his head in no trap and, and let you do that. No. No. But see, he focus, if you see if you see some cheese or some peanut butter on that trap, he going after it. And then he gets trapped. See, listen. Everybody get got in certain situations. But sometimes coming across a video like this, it, 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 it puts your antennas up to let you know, hey, calm down, assess, uh, assess what's going on, re-strategize, budget your money a little better, spend more time with the Lord. You know, hey, I know this ain't fit related, but man, look, get you, hey, if you a guy out there, get you a couple of sets of push-ups before you go to bed. You ain't got to be no macho man. But you know, you 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 always want to be able to lift your body weight. You always, you never know what might pop off. Like I say, I'm just keeping it real. I'm not sure who is for, but I I'm about to go get these sit ups in, man. You know, I ain't just telling you nothing I heard. I'm tell I'm telling you something that I'm doing. You know what I mean? But whatever your situation is, some of us the the very thing we running from, man, you should be running to that thing. Hey, I love you so much, man. And uh, if you made it to the end of this video, <laughs> here's what I need you to comment. I'm not running anymore. Once again, I need you to, if you made it to this video, comment the words, I'm not running anymore. That lets me know you were real when you made it to the end of this video. I appreciate you so much for real. I love you so much and I'll see you in the next video.